Yeah, today we're unpacking Pipeline by The Ventures. This is a song that's been with me for a long time. And it's been with many for a long time. But we start with this really cool, just, uh, you know, descending sort of scramble. So if you can think of da 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 get kind of like, you know, a 16th note grid going. One E and a two E and a T E and a fo E and a one E and a two E and a T E and a fo E and a. And then somehow just sort of calculate where you're going to start on fret 12. And by the time you're done, you know, a bunch of those, you know, 16th notes, calculate when we can be at the E string just to kind of finish in an even place. All right. And then we get right, we get right on to the, the riff, the first one. You know, it's like the first E5 or E power chord riff that we, that I learned, I think. And then, it, but it's, it's surf. So we got to keep it moving. It's not like, it's not this at all. <laughs> In the background, you'll hear like an E minor chord going. And then the melody starts right here on fret two on the A string. Examine that real quick. Let's unpack that. So we're starting with fret two and then minor pentatonic. But minor pentatonic from the B chord. And we do a little dance there, right? And then we're doing the minor pentatonic from the E chord. Right up there on the two middle strings all with frets two and four, you know? And then we reapproach, you know, the sort of like the Iron Man uh, power chord, but we open up the A string underneath it with this B5, so on frets two and four on the A and D strings. Get all, get all of that timed properly. But we've got that B chord and we're moving up to C5 and then back to B and then down to A eventually. Two and three and four and one and two. Yeah, and I think that's a pretty good place. It kind of gives us a, an idea of the song. And if um, you want to follow up on any of that, there are some other really cool guitar licks in there that we could take a look at. So just let me know. Um, hope you enjoyed it. And we'll see you again soon. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and do all of that obligatory stuff. Uh, something about dinging the bell. You know, if you ding the bell, if you wanted to hear more of these, more of these lessons, bring them on in by digging that bell. You know, every time I hear a bell, I salivate too.